Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to my channel. If you thought I was stuck before, baby boy, I'm gonna disturb you now. If you thought I was stuck before, cool with that. Okay, y'all, I bought these cute little shelves. I'm gonna show you exactly what they look like. I'll probably insert a picture somewhere right here. Yeah. Happy Valentine's guys! Happy Valentine's guys! I'm gonna put these shelves up. They're so super cute because my bathroom or my shower is just plain. It just gives plain. Yeah! Ugh! What's up, Daddy? Hmm? What's up, Daddy? Why I'm talking to Daddy? Yeah. Oh. See, you see, y'all, every time he be trying to do something to me, something like that happens to him. What happened to me? Didn't you just hit your elbow? No. All right, we'll see. That didn't happen to me. <laughs> Did you <saw> okay. <laughs> ah! These are what these shelves look like, and they're gonna look even cuter next to this eucalyptus. Okay, I need some alcohol just to clean this off. It's clean, but there's suction cups, so just to make sure. It's hard. I just want to make sure. Okay, that is so cute, but you guys, I dropped. Oh, I see it. So this set came with two like this. They had different combinations. You could have got this or like a square one if you wanted to wanted it to come off like that edge versus the corner. But my shower is already not like humongous, so I stuck with the corner. This is a smaller tray. Let me see. It could go under there, but I'll probably put the smaller one here. Yeah. Y'all, why did my baby get out the bed at 12 o'clock at night and say that he was packing his backpack to go to his nana's house? <laughs> what? So if you follow me on Instagram, you saw that I did my nails for Valentine's Day and I finally had time to do my nails to match. Just a quick overlay on my big toe and gel polish. Real cute. Quick photo session before I did some lashes. A portion of this video is of course sponsored by RN Rejuvenation LLC. RN Rejuvenation is a brand that fosters beauty and aesthetics, lifestyle and motherhood with a focus on the rest, recovery and rejuvenation that they require. Make sure you check them out at www.rnrejuvenation.com. My favorite from theirs is the extended abdominal wrap and that is how I stay snatched and keep my stomach flat just like this. Two days are left to take advantage of their 50% off sale for Black History Month, so make sure you check out www.rnrejuvenation.com.
Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to my channel. Okay, I know we said we were gonna, well, I said that we were gonna talk about it the last video and we didn't, so we're gonna talk about it this video, maybe somewhere towards the end because right now, I'm on a stretch of work. Well, not really a stretch, but I have two days of work. And we all know when I have two stretches, a stretch of work, everything shuts down because I'm tired. I can't do nothing in between that. And if I try to, I'm just going to be no good the days after work. So, yeah. I was at work and I had all these elaborate plans to go grocery shopping and stuff. And, of course, didn't happen. Well, when I left work or when I was leaving work, I knew it was gonna happen at around like six. So I ordered my groceries. I ordered all of them from Walmart today. Usually if I'm out and about, I'll probably like store hop and like get all my meat from one place or whatever. So I got like immediate meats, simple things like chicken and beef and stuff that aren't too expensive at Walmart. And then I go to the Caribbean store to get all my like meats, meats. So anyways, we'll do that maybe later on in the week. At least we have the essentials. We got Gio's milk, we got Gio's macaroni, we got the fruit cups. We are gonna try to really keep going with the breakfast every morning because that was really going good for me until there was no girls. And when I don't see no food, I just get unmotivated to even think of ideas. That's bad, but yeah. Two, it's 2.59. A real girl gotta go to work at six o'clock, y'all. Oh my God. But it's the last last little stretch. So I'm almost done putting away the groceries. That's what I'm going to finish doing real quick. I'm presentable. I'm presentable. Look, our class had made these shirts for our student nurses association. If you went to fam got you, what's that? You guys, I'm being so serious. I'm I'm saving money for real. I'm like not eating out like that. I mean, it's McDonald's and it's a couple dollars. I'm making all my own shit because every time I eat out, my stomach hurts. And I'm tired of it. My stomach just can't handle it no more. And because I'm going to try to get on a better um, schedule with Gio. I'm just trying to, you know, get that together. So I'm going to start making my own coffees in the morning. And I'm actually going to make one now with Gio's food. Some bananas, some potatoes. Some more potatoes. This is the pancakes Gio X for little pancake mini syrup. Got some apples, some graham crackers, some cheese, some yogurt covered raisins, and then a little sticker thing that was in his kid's meal. whatever cup cereal, hot cereal cup cute little top and there's a little spoon but i'm pretty sure Gio has found it so i'm gonna put some condensed milk some regular milk cut up a couple strawberries some cinnamon smallest pinch of nutmeg a drop of vanilla and you saw I put condensed milk so we're not going to put a lot of sugar but just a little bit of light brown sugar Gio's calm braid is done I'm gonna put some sugar on top. What am I talking about? Some butter. The 
this is what my instant oats are looking like. They're not even instant. They are supposed to be cooked, so we're gonna let it sit while I'm at work. Look at that, oh my God. Okay, wait. No, you guys gotta get the full, the full effect, okay? There's the condensed milk at the bottom. There's cinnamon, there's nutmeg, there's strawberries, there's oatmeal, there's brown sugar, and there's milk. So that's gonna get soft while I'm at work. And then I'll also warm it up before I eat it. So delicious, so delicious. And then my homemade Starbucks. My homemade Starbucks, y'all. Oh my God, look how cute. Get my Valentine's Day stuff in the back. Now the next thing about making my food for work is remembering to bring it to work on the way out the door. I'll get a plastic spoon at work. Okay, and then my coffee. And I need to find the lid for this. I don't know where it is. I probably threw it away, honestly, because it has a lid. And then I'll put some water. And I got some limes, put some water, ice, and limes in here because, yeah, we're trying to treat our body better. And that's with rest, or that's for rest, food, everything. I'd be like starving before I eat, but I'm getting myself on a strict regimen. Mm. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna get ready for it. And I'll be back. <sighs> I'm finally at work. But I mean, I guess I've been here for a little bit. I shouldn't say finally at work. I finally got a chance to sit down and do this video or wrap this video up. That's really all it is. We're not talking too long because tomorrow is another day. Next week is another week. Don't mind me, I look busted and crusted because as we all know, it's my last shift for the week or for my like stretch or whatever. So tomorrow we will do a little self care. We'll do a fill on my nails. <sighs> Replace, I have like two missing because I, like hit them they actually got stuck in something it hurt real bad but anyways we'll redo those and we'll give ourselves a feel tomorrow we'll probably change our wig but i don't know yet okay so the part that i said that we have to talk about the intro like my intro okay so in the last video i told y'all i've been struggling with like that self-identity after having a baby or postpartum you know, my son is three and I really feel like I'm just now starting to get back to me and get back to myself. Like if you knew me pre-baby, if you knew me pre-baby, first of all, comment in the comments because I was completely different. Like if you knew me then, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not her. She's not me. I don't, I don't know. So I'm struggling with trying to identify, you know, who I am or what I want to be or what I want to put out into the universe. So if you know me pretty baby i was itty bitty sammy everybody knew me as itty bitty sammy i'm still itty bitty and i'm still seeing and then after i had the baby it was like geo's mom comma rn like i was either geo's mom or i was a nurse and that was like kind of the content i was putting out but that really wasn't like yes it was me it's part of the pieces that define me but that wasn't me like sometimes i tell people god forgive me for saying this and please y'all don't take it the wrong way i'm grateful for my job my profession and the doors and accessibility that it has but nursing is my calling i'm good at it i'm very empathetic i love saving lives i love my patients i love people i like interacting with people i love helping people but it is not my passion like some people have a burning diet or a passion like they will nurse seven days a week and baby that's not me. That's not what I'm looking for. That's not what I'm into. That's that's never been what I was interested in. So, our uh, rejuvenation by Sammy. I am just me. I am Sammy. Like I am just Sammy. If you know me, I have a hyphenated name. And ever since I was younger, I don't even tell people the second half of my name. Like I am just Sammy. I'm just Sammy. I could be Nurse Sammy to you if you want me to be, but I am just Sammy. And RN rejuvenation is something that I do. I'm 
I'm just Sammy, y'all. I'm just Sammy. So my last video, if you guys really were paying attention, I uploaded it, then I had to delete it, and then re-upload it again because I had a copyright claim, and I still have a copyright claim because I couldn't figure out what part of the video was getting freaking copyrighted. If that happens again, literally, I'm going to have to, like, delete it and re-upload again because the goal is to be monetized. If I have copyright claims and I can't make money off of these videos, then... No. No. I don't send my videos out to get edited. I don't pay for somebody to edit my videos. Like, I take time to do all of that myself. That's probably why the shit's getting copyrighted. But... <laughs> It takes time, so I don't have time to be, you know, the money is the motive. In this video, y'all saw my shower revamp. If you're interested in those shelves, I do have them in my Amazon storefront. The link is in my bio. Make sure you check that out. Um, they're great. They're still up. They're great. They're still up. They haven't fallen. They don't even look like they're going to fall. We knock them. We hit them. We hang stuff on them. And... And I'm actually going to be really keeping up with that because if you know me, you know that I'm an Amazon girl. Amazon is at my door daily. So, might as well, right? Might as well. I'll probably do a, a different video of all of the things that I have in my bathroom or all the decorations I have in my bathroom because a lot of them came from Amazon. And I'm going to put y'all girls on because, of course, we're not gatekeeping and I'm going to put y'all on to all the stuff that i got bye see you in our next video